going on YouTube, Giasno right here, so in today's video we have an actual jailbreak release for the Apple Watch. Tim Star announced just a couple hours ago, quote, well, jailbreak time it is, have fun. And he posted a link to a GitHub project, which apparently is a jailbreak for the Apple Watch Series 3 running watchOS 4.1. Now, for those of you who are running watchOS 4.1 on the um, Series 3 Apple Watch, you can definitely use this one. But keep in mind that it is pretty much labeled as a developer jailbreak. So it's not much you can do. Apparently, you can get a shell that's pretty much it. It does have the kernel patches required, but there is no Cydia or stuff like that that you can actually use. It would be definitely interesting, but it's not the case. Anyways, he also announced, quote, got SSH working. It was a missing kernel patch after all. Pushed an update to the repo. So for those of you who want to use this uh, Apple Watch jailbreak that was released by Timstar, you need to follow the instructions on this page in here on how to run. So you need to clone the Git repo, open Xcode, so you will need a Mac, select a certificate for your application, build it and run it on your watch. It pretty much boils down to compiling the application with Xcode and running it on your Apple Watch. And that's pretty much it. Now, if you want support for more devices, the information in here is pretty much very useful. If you want to run it on watchOS 3.x, you will need to do some modifications to keyboard T, which is a data type and many other things. So yeah, you need to have some knowledge on how to program. And for 4.0 up to 4.1, you simply need more offsets. So yeah, very interesting one. It's good to see watchOS jailbreaks. They're not very popular. Apple devices are usually jailbroken. Um, the Apple TV one, the iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, but the Apple Watches are usually not jailbroken that often because there's not much you can do with them after you jailbreak them. There is no CDF for them. So you get the shell, you get SSH, so you can connect remotely from your computer to the Apple Watch and run various commands and run various binaries. And it's very useful for developers who want to find vulnerabilities and to, I don't know, assess the watch OS. But other than that, if you really want to be jailbroken on your Apple Watch, I guess you can do that. Now, I'm not entirely sure how the Apple Watches work uh, and how the uh, versioning for watchOS works, but taking a look in here on IPSW.me, the Series 3, which is supported, uh, if you go ahead and here, has multiple firmware versions, including 5.0, which is not supported, and 4.3.x, and so on. Now, according to Tim Store, this jailbreak supports watchOS 4.1. So I'm not entirely sure how old that version is or how many people are still running this version. But anyways, if you are meeting the criteria in here, you can definitely jailbreak your Apple Watch. Anyways, this is pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching. All the links for this jailbreak will be in the description down below. I'm Gio Snow. Subscribe to stay updated and peace out.